surveillance videos capture an Albuquerque criminal in the act, searching every single doorstep in one neighborhood. And what he was after makes residents very uneasy. News 13's Allison Martinez is here with the video. Allison. Madeline, in the age of technology, this burglar's thinking was pretty basic. He went looking for spare keys to get into someone's house, and it's put some west side neighbors on high alert. Digging around doorsteps, checking every mat. What the f Thankfully, this key crook couldn't find the tiny treasure he was looking for. But residents living near Unser and Ladera on Albuquerque's west side were still disturbed to see him on their surveillance cameras yesterday morning. We saw this man walking up to our door and we have three different doormats and he looked under every single one. Neighbors believe the man, who was reportedly driving an older model black Dodge pickup, was casing the neighborhood with a very specific target in mind. I think he was looking for keys. I think what he was doing, possibly looking for keys, maybe to come back late at a later time. Randy Leslie is the neighborhood watch captain and tells us the crook hit every house on the block during the 2 a.m. searching spree. It's another brazen criminal who either didn't pay attention or just didn't care about all the warning signs, surveillance cameras, and security around the neighborhood. So what's he going to do next? You know, is he going to try to break into somebody's house? You know, um, and if he does, you know, what's he going to be up against? If someone did have a key under their mat, how often do you look for those? You don't unless you need it. So someone could have a key missing. He's got it. He's going to go break into their house when they're not home or... Oh my gosh, even worse if they are home. Albuquerque police says when it comes to spare keys, give it to a neighbor rather than hiding it. APD says the most common place crooks search for keys is under a mat, in a flower pot, over the door, and in the carport. Madeline, back to you. All right, thank you, Allison. Neighbors say they lucked out because as far as they know, he didn't find any keys. If you have any information on who he is, contact 242-COPS.